Okay! We're in a real pickle here, guys. We haven't done so hot this past month. Look at this line graph. Look at our sales have dropped. That looks like it was drawn with marker. Colored pencil, actually. I made it myself this morning. It's as good as any computer. I know my company. So I need ideas. We need ideas. Give me something new, something fresh. I think if we just advertised a little more, we'd see improvement. You think a simple boost in promo will make all the difference? Well, I mean, it would reach people. That's such a half-assed idea. Such lazy input. Have you jacked off today? Excuse me? Have you jacked off today? I... I don't see how that's relevant. No one thinks more clearly than a man just off a fresh nut. Oh. Maybe that's why you're giving me such shit ideas. You haven't treated yourself today, have you? I'm not really comfortable. Have you? No. No. I haven't jacked off today. This is about clearing your mind so you can think straight. So you can do your job instead of sitting here, wasting my money on your salary. This is highly inappropriate. I agree. You're out of line. You do this every week. You can't get- You? You're fired! What? Get the fuck out! and jack off in it. Okay, I'm not doing this. You either leave this room with this cup, or you leave this building with your personal belongings. That's what I like to see. Devotion to your career. Devotion to your family. Now, can I get an idea from someone who has jacked off today? I've jacked off today. Wonderful, what do you got for me? Well, I'm thinking like, our competition has about the same prices as us, so maybe if we knocked a couple bucks off, you know, we'd be able to sell more. Right there. Right there is exactly what I'm talking about. What did you do after you woke up this morning? Uh, I just got in the shower and jacked off. He jacked off. You see, the first thing he did this morning is he rid his mind of all of his stresses, of all of his worries, any trials and tribulations that he may have with a good fat. And then he came to work and he gives me gold. That idea just might turn this company around. Thank you. Thank you. Now, what else do we have? You, lay it on me. Um, I, um, I haven't really come up with anything. Do you think he jacked off today? Definitely not. No, I don't think so either. I don't think you jacked off today. I don't think you mentally prepared yourself for the workday. What's your morning routine? Um, I wake up, I uh, get dressed, um, I have a bite to eat, and I uh, watch the news. What's on the news at 6 in the morning? Usually just traffic. Traffic and something Barack Obama said. Something about green jobs. Green jobs? And how long do you learn about green jobs even though you already have a job? Well, it's, it's not always green jobs. Sometimes it's... Um... How long do you watch the news in the morning before you leave to work? Um, 10, 15 minutes. How long did it take you to jack off this morning? Oh, uh, I mean, once I got the conditioner open, like, five minutes. So while you're sitting on your ass learning about green jobs that you don't even need, you're also putting off work. I, I never put off. Why not relieving yourself? You are packing up unwanted stress that can negatively affect not your green job, but your real job. I, I'm, so, I'm sorry. Nancy, can you come in here for a minute? What are you doing? Helping you, that's what I'm doing. for me, I left my damn glasses at home. It says that um, Mr. Davis switched your, he rescheduled your appointment from Monday at 3 to Tuesday at 4. Davis is so goddamn unreliable. 
Well, do you want me to call the office and tell them we can't do the change? No, no, that's fine. Okay, um, is there anything else I can do for you? No, that'll be good. Oh, actually, come look at this. Oh my goodness. Isn't that hysterical? That's so funny. The cat's just sitting there with that humiliating hat. That's adorable. I know. I love cats. Me too. No way. Yeah, I've had mine for six years. Eight for me. I never took you for a cat person. Oh, I love all animals. That's sweet. Yeah, I guess it is. Well, that's it for now. You like that? I love that. I love that. I, um, uh, <clears throat> she's very pretty. Listen to this guy. Very pretty. She's hot. Hot? You see those tits? Huge. And that ass. That ass. How's that make you feel? Um, awkward about and this whole situation. She's very attractive. It's why I hired her. Can you at least admit that to me, that she's very attractive? Yes, yes, she's a very attractive woman. You damn right she is. You wanna fuck her? All right, sir, really? Don't lie to me. You wanna make an erectile sandwich with those tits, don't you? Okay, this is getting ridiculous. I know I do. I wake up every morning knowing that I get to spend nine hours around that piece. Do you know how I start my day? How? Do you know how I start my day? You jack off. I jack off. I imagine those boobs in my face, and I do it number three with a dirty hand towel in the laundry room. I love my wife. I love her to death. But I do it anyway. I don't do it for me. I do it so I can come to work clear-headed and productive. I want you to promise me something. Yes? I want you to promise me that every morning, instead of watching the goddamn 6 a.m. news, you're going to fantasize about Nancy, and you're going to masturbate. Awkward. Promise me. If you can't promise me that you're going to jack off to the thought of Nancy massaging your balls, then maybe I should hire someone who can. Right! I'll jack off to Nancy instead of watching the news. Thank you. Yeah. Really? Thank you. Well, here we are. Here you go. Yeah, let's see this. What are you... This is handsome. No. I just need a lot of strawberries. Are you aware that your job is at stake? Because I can't afford for my employees to slack off because they didn't have an early morning jack off. You take this cup and you splooge into it. Right now, an empty cup means an empty desk. Do you understand? Nancy, come back in here, please. Mike is feeling a little down today. Why don't you catch him in the hallway, say hi, make some small talk, you know, something to lift his, his spirits. Oh, you know what? Take your hair down. Perfect. Thank you. A little something to get his imagination kicking. Just looking over the company. <laughs>